Hey everybody, I'm going to show you how to do the quick slashes in Ninja Gaiden 3 for the NES. So you want to start by hitting up plus jump and then alternating between that and slash. It's important not to hit slash plus up because you will throw the nimpo by accident. So a strong rhythm between up and A and then B, alternating faster like this and you should get what you want. Make sure that the sword animates for at least one frame. That means at least one frame is active. Otherwise you'll cancel it before it actually hits the enemy. So you can do it the traditional grip way, although it's a little bit harder. I like using the separate hands. Or you can make up your own method, maybe like, I don't know, clarinet style we'll call this. And uh, whatever works. If you see that hand pop out, that means he's throwing Nimpo, which is not good. That means you've hit up plus B, so you don't want that to happen. Uh, you'll waste all your Nimpo. So once again, just concentrate on that rhythm, that alternating between, and make sure you can see the sword animate. Just do what works for you, uh, but make sure you don't waste the Nimpo like I did there, especially in the case of Invincible Firewheel it takes 20 Nimpo per, and you need to keep your Invincible Firewheel for the final boss. Uh, so you don't want to be wasting it, as I did there, so preferably get better than I am at it. But that's pretty much quick slashing. It's like Ninja Gaiden 1, but much harder. And it's technically possible. Technically. See you later. See that? It's slower to do it that way. On the ground I did it. On the ground I did it. You see that? On the ground I got the same time. That would have been a 103.